kids, it's time for the game of two curtains! A game show where you get great prizes for making good chess moves and not so great prizes for making bad chess moves. I'm your host, Tom Kirtland. Hey. Now, let's meet today's contestant. His name is Josh and enjoys extreme snowboarding and origami. Hi, Tom! That's fascinating. Josh, are you ready to play the game of two curtains? Yes! Remember, you have prizes behind two curtains. One good and one bad. Make good moves to get good prizes. Make bad moves and, well, you know. All right, time to watch the board. White starts off by controlling the center by playing pawn to e4. Black now responds. Now white is going to play the king's gambit by playing pawn to f4. This is a dangerous move because it opens the front door to attack the king. Black now accepts the pawn. White should really protect his king, but does it? White plays b3. Oh, that's not good. Oh, I can see this coming. Black now checks with the queen. White has to block. Black now takes, and white recaptures. Okay, Josh. Now it's time to make moves for black. But before you start, here are your prizes that you could win. Behind curtain number one is a new bike. Behind curtain number two is a used napkin. Okay, Josh. What should black do next? Remember, it's a good move. You'll get a good prize. But if it's a bad move, well, you won't get that good of a prize. All right, Josh, what is your answer? Queen takes the pawn for check, Tom. Ah, uh, sorry, Josh. You get a used napkin. I wanted to get a napkin anyway. Taking the pawn is great, but taking the rook is even better because it is worth five points instead of only one. All right. Now let's go back a few moves because white knows better than to give up his own rook. So now white will play h3. All right, it is time to play game of two curtains again. Behind curtain number one is a puppy. Behind curtain number two is a banana peel. What should black do next? Queen to e4, take the pawn and check the white king. Whoa! Hmm. Let's check with the judges. Judges, what is the answer? Ah, oh, congratulations. You just won a banana peel. Mmm, yummy. A banana peel. Don't worry, Josh. It's a great move because it forks the king and the rook. But there's just one small problem. White can make one move to save the rook and pin your queen at the same time. Can you find this move? Uh, hmm, knight to f3. No, no, wait. Queen to d2 to block the check, right? Correct! Yes! The white queen pins the black queen. Now black can't move to capture the rook. All right, Josh, the correct move was to make a discovered attack by playing... Oh, yeah. Pawn g3 to g2. All right. Yes, correct. This move is really great because you put the king in check and you also put the rook in danger. The king runs away. All right, Josh, it's time to play Game of Two Curtains again. Behind curtain number one is a new jet ski. Behind curtain number two are kisses from your Aunt Sue. But I like my aunt's kisses. What's your move going to be? Um, take the rook and get a new queen. Yeah, All yeah. right, <laughs> you got two queens on the board. You can't lose now. Congratulations, you've just won kisses from your aunt. What? Oh. Ah. The correct move was to take the pawn for check. This was a really good move because we are getting ready to checkmate the king. You'll find more about this later as we move through the game. All right, Josh. So far, you haven't gotten any moves correct. And you have won some pretty bad prizes. I'm going to have to warn you, this is the final round of Game of Two Curtains. Yeah! 
Now, let's take a look at your prizes. Behind curtain number one, you could win a trip to Hawaii. But if you get it wrong, you will get a trip to the dentist. All right, Josh, this is important for a trip to Hawaii. Mm. What is your move going to be? Take the rook and get a new queen again. All right, again, with two queens, you cannot lose. Yes. You just won a trip to the dentist. Oh, I am sorry. I needed to go to the dentist anyway. Just think, the king is in a real pickle. He has only two squares to move to. What piece could take away both of these squares? A bishop! A bishop! A bishop! True, but you don't have the right bishop to do that job. What strange move could you make? Well, there's a concept in chess called under promotion. Under promotion is when you promote to something less than a queen. In this case, promoting your pawn to a knight oh, will deliver checkmate. Like so. Look, the knight attacks the king and also guards the last remaining square the king could go to. This, my friends, is checkmate. Ooh, I am sorry, Josh. This was a very hard game, and you did a wonderful job. We also have some parting gifts for you, so you won't feel that bad. And I want to thank you for watching and tune in next time for the Game of Two Curtains.